I think everything's working. This might be a first for Monday. This time the technical the the, the tech issue was uh um between um between the chair and the keyboard. A pep cac. Um So, yeah. It's been a week. Took the week off last week because my cough was just, oh. So, I wanted to at least recover a bit. I think I've recovered a bit. But I'm going to be um, limiting my streams to just a couple of weeks now. Until I'm um, fully better. Da, da, da. Thank you for the convincing the vigil. It's just a red car. I think the acquiesce. I understand that they were reluctant. But perhaps the sign of shared mourning will help lead to new healing growth. Please accept these gifts. May they aid your inquisition in its quest. And I got a great... Ooh, chromatic great sword. I mean, I can make one. I think I don't have anything left to do on the war table. Other than resources and a couple uh, and, and a couple quests, I don't have anything to do. Um, I think it's yells. I made myself a new outfit. Look at this. It's, uh, 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 you can see my shoulder now. Yeah, I made a new outfit. Okay, so we're gonna help Josie first. Because that may have some more table operations. Okay. She's going to be way over here. I'm going to go here. With my normal group. I remember my group. It's been a week, but... I've still been doing stuff. I kind of adjust that so my... Bodies, kind of. Uh... Sorry, I'm adjusting my lap, my, my computer here, my laptop. It's a laptop. Why am I? Why am I being like, oh, guys, that's my computer. It's my laptop. I stream from a laptop. Another reason why I'm playing old games. Also, sucking on a lozenge right now, so. Okay. Can't really level up anymore. You're rather insolent for a servant, aren't you? You're a mage, not my patron. I've no reason to be polite to you. Your patron is my patron, and he tasked you to accompany me. <laughs> to report should any Templars attack you, not cater to your every whim. Elves, am I right? I should be feeling better now. Those who had been cast down, the demons who would be gods, began to whisper to men from their tombs. Temp uh chant trace. Didn't I see you with her once? I've passed her on and repent friends who has faith been shaken by the darkness of the world. You admit it? Just and like both that? And not, nor gloats uh, there are the some lots. Of the weak. Well, sometimes. The it's hard to Lord explain. She shall know so that's a friend. Then the maker said, To you, my second born, I grant this gift. In your heart, I'm gonna go over there. Okay, I'm well away from you. Can you shut up now? Chanters. Is there something you know where this noble wanted to meet us? 
I do. The Comte Boisvert has invited us to his mansion, not far from here. I pray he clears up the deaths of my messengers, as promised. Well, let's go see him. Lead the way. I'll take, we'll take these guys with us. Because, uh, kind of need to. Still feeling a bit under the weather. Still sucking on cough drops. But hopefully I'll, I'll be able to stream. At least these quests. Welcome, my friend. Oh, we're friends. How lovely. Thank you for seeing us, Comte Boisvert. The honor is mine. Please, sit. It's an honor to assist two such distinguished guests. How do I sit in that chair with that sword? It's got to be very uncomfortable. Very. Very uncomfortable, I tell you. Very uncomfortable. I hope helping us doesn't endanger you. Hardly. Even a brush with someone as well-known as yourself can become a great asset in Valroyo. Giving you the identity of those who murdered Lady Montilly's messengers seemed the least I could do. Have you heard of the House of Repose? The Assassin's League? My yes. Obtained a copy of I guess he did. In the archive. Contract for a life. House of Repose is hereby sworn to eliminate anyone attempting to overturn the Montelier's trading exile in Orlais. Oh. Huh? Who's sending these assassins? The contract was signed by a noble family. The Du Paraquettes. But the Du Paraquettes died out as a noble line over 60 years ago. Indeed. But the contract was signed 109 years ago. How can a family try to kill you after they died out? The Du Paraquettes were our rivals. They drove the Montelliers from Val Royaux. This contract was drawn up over a hundred years ago, but it wasn't invoked until I tried to overturn my family's exile. Ah. Unpleasant though it may be, the House of Repose is merely fulfilling its contractual duties. But, um, can I old? If the people who wanted your family dead are gone, why are the assassins still after you? A contract is a contract, Inquisitor. Orlesian businesses live and die by their reputations. The entire guild's welfare would be endangered if an agreement was tossed aside on a whim of time or fate. She's quite right, Your Worship. The House of Repose is doing what it feels necessary. By its standards. So... I assume you have a thought or two on this, Josephine. The two paraquets still have descendants under the common branch. If we elevate them to nobility, a two paraquet could annul the contract on my life. Uh, that will take time, Lady Montelier. Time during which the House of Repose will be obliged to hunt you. Will they now? You are exceedingly well informed. You're not to have said you'd heard rumors at best. A bit of subterfuge. This contract on your life is an ugly business. When the House of Repose deeply regrets. No, they don't. No, I just figured it out, didn't you, huh? Yeah, you just figured it out. I'm guessing the actual Comte Boisvert met with a fatal accident. Comte Boisvert slumbers in a nearby closet. Nothing more. The contract on Lady Montilly's life is so unusual... We felt the courtesy of an explanation was in order. Oh, the plate assassins. That's good. Monsieur? Your idea to seek out the Duparaquette to revoke our orders is uh, an interesting one. I wish you luck. Oh, no, thank you. I did not come to shed blood today, Inquisitor. Only to speak. Might I pass? Yeah, yeah go right ahead. No. 
I don't want to piss off a League of Assassins. No, no offense. Go then. Good and he already explained day. why. My lady. More just like. Never meet again. More like uh, this is weird. Uh, we should let them know what's going on. Well, I didn't think our meeting would end like this. We'll yeah. Deal with these assassins. I have some thoughts. Let's discuss them back at Skyhold. I, don't, I, don't, I feel I'm... safer with the castle's walls around. Do you hear something? Mm. Oh, goodness. Uh, Comte Poivre, is that you? Mm. Oh, the lock's been broken off. We'll find a saw. Mm. I realize the cabinet is quite valuable, Comte, but surely... Mm. A locksmith, then? Mm. Mm. As you wish. I wonder if I can get Let's see if I can get out of here. There's stuff over there to break. I want to break stuff. Look at that. That's stuff to break right there. And right there. Got a pot there, a pot there. Now there's a pot, like a pot down there. Not time for the Inquisitor to make a fool of himself again. Okay, back to Skyhold. Oh, and I can't save. How am I going to get out of there if I can't save? How am I going to break out with mods and go to places I'm not supposed to go? I want to go places I don't. I'm not supposed to go. I don't like that. I want to do fun stuff. Oh, well. Do, 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 And now talk to Josephine. What's my inventory looking like? Did I put stuff away? No, I did not. Okay. Inquisitor. Yeah, I'm running out of stuff here. It's a problem with trying to complete things. I should try to load up at least so, some stuff here, right? I want that gun thing that the that they had. Get rid of all this stuff. Now I'll drop stuff off and then I can go back and play.
Okay, now to talk to Josephine. Now that I'm not weighed down with all my guilt. Right? Right. Mmm. Yeah, tired still. Okay. Whoops. Josephine's right over here. I'm so sorry, Inquisitor. I never thought my family's trading status would trap us in an assassin's plot. Eh. You couldn't have known it would lead to this house of repose coming after you. At least it's not the crows. They shouldn't have slipped past me. I've tracked down the last two barraquettes. If they become gentry, they can annul the contract on my life. Will require a noble from Val Royale to sponsor them, a judge to provide documents, a minister to ratify them. It's still like you to take the longest course of action, even when your life is at stake. I assume you already know everything about this matter. Oh, she knows everything about everything. There is an after way, Josephine. The original contract on your life is in the vaults of the House of Repose. If my agents infiltrate it and destroy the original, the assassin will have no obligation to chase you. Liliana, please. I want no more bloodshed over a personal affair. Don't be so stubborn, Josie. How long will it take you to gather these favors in Val Royale? Ah. Oh. So, this will get some more bloodshed pretty quickly. And this will take some bloodshed over the course because uh, chances are they'll um, infiltrate Skyhold and we'll have to kill them. But unfortunately, I'll be off camera because, uh, well, we can't have any fun we in Skyhold. This without more deaths on either side. My people are ready. Should you change your mind, I'll post a watch on our ambassador in case the House of Repose visits. I appreciate it, but I still believe elevating the Duparakets will solve. This. Which is what we're gonna do. First, we need to perform some favors in Barwayo. I'd be happy to discuss where we could begin. Okay. Any news on the House of Repose, Inquisitor? You said I'd have to do some favors in Val Royale if we want to make the Duparakets lords. The Countess Dion is our first step. Her lover, a mage from the White Spire, is missing. Bring her news of him and she'll be very amenable to sponsoring the Duparakets as lords. Okay. So it's an operation. Ugh. <clears throat> Back to the war table. Okay. I'm going to go with Cullen on this one. All right. Meanwhile... Do I just travel here from the map? I don't remember. It's been a while since I've done this stuff. Valence. While we're doing that. I mean, I don't know I don't need to bring these people with me. This is just a simple thing. Let's see if I remember how to do this one. I don't think I do. I wish we had desired demons in this game. Not just some annoying little choice spirit. It's 
just as I remember it. You didn't tell me you'd been here before. After the blight ended, I came here to see Justinia. She was just Dorothea then, a revered mother. I didn't expect it to be so... deserted. It makes me uneasy. It's a small village, and it's too early for the chant. I'm sure the sisters are somewhere. Speaking of which... Is that you? She came right out of a wall? Natalie, what are you doing here? I thought you were in Val Rayo. No. I've been here since Justinia died. This place makes me feel like... Don't trust her. Like she's still with us. Inquisitor, this is Natalie. A trusted friend. Wait, Inquisitor? You... You brought the Inquisitor... No. No, he's My back Lord, at Skyhold. Forgive me for not recognizing you earlier. I wish more people would fail to recognize me. Oh, uh... I see. It's hard not to recognize me, though. I'm the one in the purple armor. something hidden here. Something Justinia left for me. Oh, really? What is it? I don't know, but we'll find it. I'm curious to see what brought us all here. Justinia's letter came with instructions. See, she came right out of there. They were a little cryptic. Always remember that faith sprung from a barren branch. Right out of there. That light has no fear of darkness. Above all, that strength lives in an open heart. She must be hinting at something in here. Let's look around. Do they still sing verses from the Benedictions every Friday? That canticle was Justinia's favorite. Uh, yes, of course. We'd never give up the traditions of our most beloved divine. That is lovely to hear. I stare up at the breach sometimes. It's terrifying, but beautiful in its way. You we closed the breach. Okay, that's the last one. It takes courage to trust. What was that? Looks like we opened something. It does? Justinia built something. She built this with her own two hands. Sorry to keep you waiting. Eh. After the house of repose, I want to be. I, I want to be intelligent. Good old Leliana was playing you the whole time. Didn't you realize? They never sing the benedictions here on Fridays, Natalie. Something so simple. And you got it so wrong. I wanted to believe, but you were lying from the start. Keep that pretty mouth shut if you must, dear. You've already told me everything I need to know. The prickle with burrs on your hand, talking about the sun rising through the breach. It all points to a single place. Morel in the Dales, Grand Cleric Victoire's Bastion. She sent you, didn't she? Victoire was always an opportunist. So, who? Who is this grand cleric? I've never heard of her. Well, an experienced cleric. She never agreed with Justinia, but kept I mean, her I'm an elf. Herself. Why would I ever hear about this stuff? Now, with Justinia dead, she thought she could make her move. 
So what's going on now? I want to know what this grand cleric planned here. She sent Natalie here to see what Justinia was hiding, no? The Inquisition has turned Thedas away from the true Chantry. It must be stopped. Stop us? You must be joking. Mother Victoire is well loved by many. The Inquisition has more enemies than you know. And Victoire thinks she can ally with them. We don't have to be at odds, Natalie. You could come with us. Join the Inquisition. I was called to serve the Grand Cleric. I will not betray her. Kill me then. I am not afraid to die for I think I may have hardened Liliana, so this might get kind of gruesome. Okay, you know what? Let's see if I've hardened Liliana. I don't remember. It's been a while. I think, though, I think Natalie's probably going to die. We don't have to kill uh, her. No. I must protect me, I hardened her. She is an enemy. I see what you've become. The righteous stand before the darkness, and the maker shall guide them. <laughs> Yeah. Um. Sorry, I didn't mean to do that. I must have forgot. Oh, I think I did want to harden Liliana though. Right? If if Liliana becomes divine. There's nothing here. Check again. Perhaps the box itself is a puzzle. She seemed the puzzling sort. No, it's just it's just an empty box. There's a message carved in the lid. The left hand should lay down her burden. She... She's releasing me. The Divine has a long reach. But it is always her left hand that stretches out. A thousand lies, a thousand deaths. Her commands, but my conscience that bore the consequences. She apologized in the Fade. She said she failed you. This is what she meant. All this time, Justinia carried the fear that she was using me. Just like I'd been used in the past. But Marjolaine's games were trifles. Justinia gambled with the fate of nations. She needed me. No one else could have done what I did. She knows that. Then you have to let it go. Let her go. You don't owe her anything anymore. This? Now? After everything you've said and done, and my poor dear Natalie, I called her sister once, but I yeah, can't risk um... leaving her alive. Don't tell me to let it all go after all I've sacrificed to get here. I'm gonna hide now. Justinia tried to save me, but all it's done is made me realize I don't need saving. There is work to be done. I'll see you back at Skyhold. Whoopsie. Well, what do you have, Natalie? Anything good? But I'm still going to loot bodies. Not like I'm not going to loot a body here and there. I mean, come on. I got to loot the bodies. Okay, I still got some time. So I'm going to go to here. I'm going to do this quest while I wait. And that's the problem with Josephine's ones. It's a like all war tables. All war tables. All war tables. Too many war tables. Too many. Sorry, I wanted to adjust my mic.
someone's been here. A small book appears to be a collection of notes judging by their dates, written over a period of three years. The Chronicle is search of for something called Thurthamon's Wisdom by an Orlesian archivist, Lord Grecian Fa. The Elven God of Secrets disappeared along with her all his kin, or so the legends claim. Yet his priesthood remained behind, and the priests were said to possess the ability to see and know all. I believe this to be a result of magic and not a divine gift. Magic locked in treasures that remain to this day. With the aids of my companions, I hope to prove it. I believe I found the temple of Dathamen, the resting place for the wisdom, or at least the location of the last high priest who was said to possess it. From all I have gathered, it might be possible to summon this high priest's spirit from the ether here in this place. Impossible? Yet Dirthamen's rituals will evidently allow it. Perhaps one of the old secrets we know will be revealed to us here. Okay. Oh, I hate this place. I forgot how much I hate this place. This is the one I get lost in. Fine. Whisper here where the shadow dwells. Some words remain un unuttered. Yeah. Truths are pushed down, down, where they shall never rise again. It's strange that I can understand that. Ancient magic at work, allowing any who come to understand the secrets of this place. Chamber of Misery, such a cheerful place. Okay, so I have to take the head of Misery. Such a cheerful object. <laughs> Okay, I made a mistake of taking coal down here, too. Nothing today gonna go right. Coal's just gonna make things creepy.
creepiness. That's what it's made out of. Let's go this way. I need something that's down there. I'll light this one later once I can... Through. I'm going down here first. And here's where the magic happens. Literally. Okay, then we're not going to go there yet. Requires a key. Of course it does. Why wouldn't it? Magically sealed, of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? Uh, this human man was a warrior, dead uh, for perhaps a few months. His skin is dried and stretched over his bones. From what you can tell of the corpse, he was stabbed in the back. An expression of terror remains locked in the rictus of this dead man. Okay, lovely. Chamber of Torment, such a lovely place. Call. Crypts of the Forgotten. I don't care Lord, what Lord Grishian claims. There are voices last night whispering to us in our sleep. It is not silly fears it is this place. Is it worth finding this artifact he hunts if it attracts spirits to us as we search? And how do the spirits know our names? They knew personal things. Offense I would rather forget. I would leave if I don't... Uh, 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 uh. Okay, the, the, this uh, pendulum movement in Waruto is oh, is kind of fun. Um, they knew personal things. Offense, I would rather forget. I would leave if it did not mean foregoing my entire pay after months of work. Vivian, do I need the last one? Our highest one, he deceives us. The honey words that trip from his tongue. We know the despair that they mask. We disciples of Dirthamon know the truth. Now as ever. Hands of torment, huh?
Okay, I got the orange. Rail fire's creepy too. Don't know what that did. I'm going this way. Okay, so I've been in here. That's why I like the torches. Magically sealed. Okay, it's the wrong door. It's this door that I needed. So this is where the key leads. Yeah, didn't you read the text? It said requires ornate key. That was the ornate key. Okay, this is my jam. Breaking stuff. That's what I'm good at. Need veil fire. This is why I get lost so easy. Okay, I'm going to come back to that one. Need veil fire. We'll go back this way again. If Dorian will get out of my way. Okay, what's that way? You know, we'll avoid the water though. Okay, we're somewhere outside. That's nice. I thought I heard a rune. There it is. We will not have it. We will not, or, well, yeah, we will not have it. We'll not have it. The secrets are madness in our ears, but they are ours. The highest one cannot take them from us. 
Only Dirthamen, our keeper. Only he. And if he does not take the secrets, they are ours forever. Okay, wonderful. Like the brazier. Empty and my feet are soaking wet. For his heart, for his heart, our highest one is bound. The secret that he keeps, he keeps with us. The vigil that he keeps, he keeps with us. His fear not, will not weaken us. No one shall come, dear mentor. In our eternity, only darkness reigns. And we've been through here. Okay. This is where we came in. What's this? By Varric. Okay. Chapter 7. Well, some elf had some good taste. Two more. I think I've been all over in this area. I'm going to double check. Been in this room. And there's a rune, and I keep losing my torch. Okay.
guys weren't supposed to follow me. You're supposed to stay where you are so I can find the spot where I need to go again. They will come for us in the night, those who would steal the words from our lips, and our God no longer rises to our defense. We claw at the walls, at the walls. Now we pray for a dawn that will never arrive. Totally not creepy at all in this place. Totally just a normal... Normal place for some lunch. Can okay, go through there. Or I can go over here. The ears of unheeding. That would be the ghoul's beard on the other side. Okay, time to lose this torch. Need veil fire. I need veil fire. Not fire fire. His mind which cannot think, his tongue which cannot speak, his hand which cannot touch, his ears which cannot hear, his eyes which cannot see. And thus shall our highest one be bound. He shall join us in our silence.
Okay. Been in here then. Notes are scribbled on this scroll. Many crossed out or written in terse, angry letters. Reveal the heart. Unite it with the flame. Together they will form the key to liberation? Advancement? The translation is not clear. I also do not think this brazier is the flame it speaks of. Okay, I put it right over there so I could find it again. Okay, so that turns off the water. So now I need veil fire again. Think it was this way? And Dirthamin is gone, he said. Our highest one brings us to this great brings us this gravest news. What shall we do? Where shall we go? What of the old secrets that burn within our hearts? Okay. Now we go down in here. Wherever the staircase is. Read. A series of papers and notes are stuffed into a small booklet. It is stained with dried blood and covered in dust. The most eligible entry is in the last. We're still not certain why Lord Gretchen ran off during the night. The others think it's a nightmare. Well, they say it's the voices that speak to them. We took a vote and decided to continue to the search for Dirthman's wisdom. If we don't, we forfeit everything we've worked towards. 
Trying to piece together all of Christian's notes won't be easy. All I can think is that we need to put these relics revealed by the braziers into the fl these flames. It's all part of some elven ritual, I suppose. The only gruesome part is all these desiccated organs. Lord Gressian believed they were part of the high priest of this temple, and that we're somehow reassembling him. I find it unsettling that the elves were to have disassembled their high priest in the first place. Bringing those organs here, putting them back together. Who knows what will happen? Bad will happen. That's what's going to happen. Bad. I think we all know that. Elf smash! Yeah, I can take this one easy. So that was the high priest of the temple. Filled with despair and imprisoned forever by his own followers. How lovely. Such lovely people, elves. Ancient elves. Oh, that place. Chamber of the Oracle, over here. Hopefully. Okay, so I got one more rune to find, huh? There we go. 
The highest, <clears throat> the highest one promises safety. I shall protect our ancient secrets. He claims all that Earth men once granted us will be safe. But it is our blood he seeks. A sacrifice dark and holy, unholy. Prison of evil to keep us in and all else out. Now he's going to find the way out. Now I got the last one. I just need to get out of here. Just the way out. Okay, back to Skyhold. Whoops, yeah. I'm gonna take a quick second and get myself something to drink. I'm just gonna mute. I'm, I'll be right back. I try to put my drink a little farther away. But I didn't. I had, like, behind me, like, by, by a foot. I thought I put it, like, on the other side of the room. My mouth is getting pretty dry. Okay. Let's see how much further I have to go. And, um. Oh, I should also do that, too. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Okay. No, nope, Baldy's still over there. Not sitting drinking tea. Screw it. Dorian? I do love how you're always on the go. It's tiring to watch you. You need to watch me more. No, I was planning we just uh, you know go up to my quarters uh, and uh, you watch me um take these clothes off. Hmm? I was hoping hmm? to steal a moment alone with hmm? you. You have but to ask. Amatus. Lead the way. Well, I need to get the kiss. Over here and hide. Okay, I got my kiss. Making sure he's still moving. Grand cleric Retois is scrambling after the loss of her ancient. Good. Her support base is in morale. Tear it down. Morale or her support base? Please just say her support base. I don't, I don't want to tear down a town. It's too much work. Grand Cleric Victoire wishes to make an enemy of the Inquisition. I'll give her what she wants. Doesn't Victoire have a young cousin? Lord Firmin? She dotes on him. Um. Yes, mistress. I believe that is so. Good. Have him collected. He shall be an honored guest. And make sure the Grand Cleric hears about it. At your command. Okay. Everything all right? Is everything under control? Perfect. 
The Grand Cleric and others like her will fall in line soon enough. You see, when I'm ruthless, it gets us where we need to be. It's something to be proud of. Why fix it? How funny that her regret is what finally what puts my own to rest. I chose to become her left hand, knowing what it meant. It was my weakness that stopped me from fully committing to my task. You have a good heart. It's not a weakness. You are too kind, Inquisitor. Call it what it is. The Inquisition needs me just as the Divine did to do what no one else dares. Yeah, that's going to end bad. Trade. It is what I am. It is what I always will be. Sorry, Warden. Um. Yeah. Almost. Almost landed right on the desk. Almost. Is the correct way out? Yes. War table. Okay. Almost. I need a much better chair than this one. Okay. Ah, oh, my dearest Lynette, I was entering on the way back from the Conclave. When this insane war erupted between the apostates and the Templars, I made it to a decrepit inn just before the gash of my leg turned into a fever. Fortunately, when the Inquisition's people found me, they sent for a proper healer. I owe them my life, I'm certain. I'm told the Inquisition will deliver this letter to you, which is the first peace of mind I've had since the Conclave. Stay in the capital, my love, until I can come to you. Yours always, Elderly. Okay. Now back to Vivian or Josephine. Maybe I'll actually have something to do this time. Otherwise, I still got another place to go check for, for stuff. Another LV place. Any news on the House of Repose? the next favor we need to get these duparakets a lordship? We need a judge of the royal court to procure documents acknowledging them as nobility again. Okay. Let's go to Valerio. It's all the way over there. Okay. I'm going to do this one by myself. If I remember what buttons to hit. Yes. I'm going to Val Rayo. It's safe. It is perfectly safe in Val Rayo. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. You've heard there's a defender working with the Inquisition. No. I thought the Inquisition was battling the Imperium. What? Why would that happen? If Deventer invaded us, I think we'd know. It's not an invasion. Cultists and the like. 
but I highly doubt the one in the Inquisition is like that. No, he isn't. And what would you do if Templars did attack me? Applaud. It's the least you deserve for abandoning your fellow mages. I should join the rebellion even if I don't agree with it. I did the smart thing and got myself a wealthy patron. You did the cowardly thing. You hide under our patron's skirt while your brethren die. All gods will call you. From their ancient prisons they will sing. Dragons with wicked eyes and wicked hearts. On black and green does deceit take flight. What an unexpected the pleasure. Of my children you must have had a long journey to the city. Might there be any news from this house? Here's a letter from Ellerly. He's safe with his family in the Dales. Oh, my Ellerly. Oh, bless you. The Dions will sponsor the Duparakets as a family deserving of a noble title, Inquisitor. You have my word. Now, please forgive my hastiness, but I must read Ellerly's words. Make her keep you. Okay. I felt it was, you know. Only plight. Oh, uh, back to Sky. Plus, I wanted something to do. Mm. Hmm. Okay, come on. Load. Loading, loading, loading. Get the game alone. Loading, loading, loading. Woohoo! Okay. Come on. Load. One thing I did last week to keep my sanity up is I started watching Babylon 5 again. I'm at the end of season four. Maybe I'll even watch all five seasons. Inquisitor. What happened here? The House of Repose decided to pay a visit. The guards arrived in time, but I should have guessed the assassins would infiltrate the servants. Are you sure they didn't hurt you? They only frightened me. It was all so sudden. Leliana assigned people to shadow me. They appear to have saved my life. I owe you everything, Sergeant. Only my duty, Ambassador. I'll talk with the spy master about these murderous louts. She'll find how they got in. Probably by getting jobs. <laughs> Did I do it Josie's way? Oh, my back. There we go, judge. Must have an alert. You can judge sign the papers formally requesting that we elevate the two paraquets into nobility. I approach Judge Ald, who's requested a party of Inquisition soldiers, meet him in the prospects for a hunting expedition. Some sort of rare spider. As big as a horse. Ugh. The judge was telling me. He lives inside a cave a few days west of Skyhold. He would uh, like an honor guard who knows the mountains to show him the way. Send some scouts and officers to accompany him, and the judge all will happily sign the paperwork we require. Inquisitor. Okay. Almost. While we wait, 
Let's save Sutherland and company. Sorry about that. Still coughing. I'm going to save Sutherland and company. If the game loads. Because you can see by that little... Over there, yeah, yeah, it's, it's still, it's still not loading. No, thank you. It's on the other side of the river. And this Templar. Elf smash! Okay. We're done. No, we're not. We still got a lot to do. Can I save a friend's life? Oh. Save a member of the Inquisition's life. Somewhere over that way. And they're down this way. No, I'm a guy who just likes swinging his big sword around. Sutherland? I knew you'd come. Rat's a good runner. We saved a caravan but lost the fight. We saw your flag and we're hoping we were good for a ransom. What, Dark Spawn? They learned we were nobody, we were as good as dead. But here you are. Of course I'm here. You are an adventuring company of the Inquisition. You hear that? Did everyone hear that? We heard it, you fool. Inquisitor, we'll return to the hold, and we'll be back out in no time. Thank you. Okay, I took care of that. And back to Skyhold. Come on. 
load. Load. I want to get to sky hold. I'm going to save at sky hold. Okay. Okay, good. Okay, I am going to take a bit of a break and just get around and move around and stretch a little bit. So I will be back in a few minutes. See you on the flip side. Okay, there we go. Sorry, I, I wanted to get up and move around a little bit. Stretch my back out. Okay. Okay. War table. Okay. Oh, sorry about that. I like I said I needed a stretch. I've been sitting in a comfy chair. Oh, wait. I got a minute. Okay, you know what? I'm going to stay in Skyhold for this next war table operation. I'm going to go talk to um, Sutherland. Actually, you know what? I'm going this way. Okay. Nope. Through the kitchen. And outside. Oh, I forgot I got a war table for him. Okay. Well, let me go get some cookies. Let me get some friendly roof time with my be with my bestie. You, yes. I, I I haven't got friendly roof time in bed, so. When we. Windings weren't for sale. It's poetry because of W's and shit. <laughs> wrong way. <coughs> wrong way. <coughs> Okay, I'm getting a cough drop right now. Yeah. Sorry about this. I need a cough drop.
Okay. With Josephine ready to report in. Judge Alt is sending the papers. We need to present the Dupe Riquettes as nobility again. Now there's one step left. A royal minister must ratify them. Please come see me when you have a chance. The judge places on his compliments, by the way. Apparently the hunt was a marvelous bit of sport. And the soldiers acquitted themselves bravely against something called a screaming man-eater. The infirmary reassures me the church shall make a full recovery. Yeah, that's the problem with spiders. Inquisitor. Yeah, we'll do that one. Okay, let's talk to Josephine. See if this one's done yet. Okay, and where's she? The minister will be at a small fete thrown by the Marquis with Scott. I'll get you an invitation. Oh boy. Another war table operation. Must be this one. Forgive the late reply. Wonderful it is to hear from you. I have just ridden from trouble in the Dales. The Civil War has made managing my holdings even more difficult. It'd be much easier if I had the ear of a council of heralds, but alas, fortune left, has left me poor in that regard. The Inquisition is always welcome at one of my humble feats, fets, foots, foot. I only regret that it may not be as grand as I would like. Please, dear lady, promise me you will warn his worship that my preoccupation will preclude a richer evening with my guests. Inquisitor. Okay, 15 minutes. <clears throat> then let's get the blade. Well, we got a spirit with us, too, so spirit should be safe from us. Right? 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 I, I think so. Oh, my arm. Ugh. I think I lean, must have been leaning on it or something. Definitely very stiff.
Okay, come on. Sorry, I'm rotating my chair. So this is where the Sulavine blade was lost. Lots of things are lost here. Well, that's comforting, Cole. Well, this must have been beautiful at night. I'll let you handle this one, Vivian. It must be up there. Be swift and silent. Fear the sun, the way of the arrow. So I'm not really talking that much. As the sapling bends, so must you. Fear the sun, the way of the bow. As elf and muscle man, um, I don't do that. Receive the gift of the hunt with mindfulness. Fear at the len, the way of the wood.
I'll smash. Part of the sword. The elves broke it after all. That corpse was possessed by a, pr by a pride demon. No doubt drawn by the elves' use of blood magic. There must be more altars. Must be. Okay, I've been here-ish, maybe. It was once a sacred place. Othran cared only that the veil was thin. He knew the right. We did not question it. Now I wonder what fell spirit whispered in his ear. Poor cried as her own would cry. The blade cut each throat as, and they were silent. Human blood taken as elven blood had been. Innocent blood. I let the spirits take the bodies. I let the others fall. Therein lies the justice we deserve. With what strength remained, I sealed them. With what strength remained, I, Hedolin, declare that we were wrong. For a moment, the scent of fresh blood oh, hangs in the air, then it fades. Lovely. Lovely. Oh, here's one right here. I'm going to save that one. Okay. I don't know if Dorian even helped in that fight. I thought I saw something over here. Oh, 
I'm going down. Okay, this way. These are simple fights, at least. Ooh, gold. I can always use money. <laughs> One more piece. You know what? Safe for stupid. Okay, so I've been down here. So I've been to the one I marked. Gotta be around here somewhere, probably down below. They gotta find a way down. Because up is just a sky.
on, I got purchases from Kirkwall all the way out here. The Kirkwall Post Office is a very, very good post office. Cole. That's the rune. I don't need the rune. Okay. It's gotta be a way down. Up oh, there it is. Is it? Is, yep, here it is. Probably. I want to make sure I got everything. Okay. I'm going to go that way. And then this way. And back to Skyhold. Come on. Load. Load. Mm. Come on, load. I am running out of steam already today. I can feel it. Okay, I'll take this back to Dagna in a second. Got a war table operation. For some reason, I'm not feeling very clever today. I think my mind's like all jumbled up. It's all jumbly wumbly.
Probably because I, you know, probably lack of sleep or not sleeping well or something. I don't know. I felt like I slept well last night. And I don't hear any audio from the game. Uh, I have the table in place of the Marquis party. Must find a way to speak with Menarder Belize privately about ratifying the new parakets. Return to nobility. It's the last step we need. She holds the success of this entire endeavor in her hands. Okay. Okay, hear music. Just not sound effects. Okay. And where is Marquise's party? Over here. I feel bring the mages. They're fancy. Get two fancy mages. They should be good at a little party. Or a feet, or a fete, or a foot, or whatever it is. Thank you for seeing me in private, Minister Belize. I chastise you for taking me from the party, Inquisitor, but the Marquis throws such dull affairs, it's hardly worth it. I assume you wish to discuss your petition to elevate these du paraquettes to a minor lordship. I'll try to help out, Josephine. Tell me, why should I allow you to pollute the Orlesian nobility any further than it's already been muddled? Hmm. Uh, I think I'm going to go with this one. The Duparakets used to be noble. You'd be restoring an old house of Orlais. <laughs> restoring it far too late. What are the Duparakets now? Traders? Farmers? Really, it is too much. The very thought causes me pain. What can you possibly provide that will make your petition worth my effort? Hmm. Oh, I was hoping for a flirt, the flirty option. That's because I'm in a serious relationship. Darn. Darn! I'm in a serious relationship. I can't do the flirty option because of that. Foo. Diplomatic connections that reach far beyond the boundaries of Valroyo, perhaps? Hmm. I might make use of your ambassador. The Montilliers aren't what they were, but at least they're from proper stock. Arrange for me to be introduced to the court of Antiva. I hear winter is most pleasant by their sea. I want to go and there by their sea. Inquisitor. Should you fulfill this bargain, I shall... Raise the Duparakets into lordship. If I was only single. F foo. Darn. I only was in a relationship with Dorian. I could have done the funny flirty option. Instead of the boring... The boring connections option. <sighs> okay, game. This was not worth the loading. Mm. Nice. 
Gotta get comfy. Okay. The audio has crapped out on it. On the game. Speak with Josephine. Okay. I must return to Valrayo to see that everything is in order. Please join me when you can. Okay, I will. This should deal with the House of Repose. And if not, we'll just have Liliana sneak in and murder everybody. Hey, Dagna. Got something for you. You're the magical advisor. Oh, you're him. The Inquisitor. I'm Dagna. Arcanist Dagna. It's an honor you're working. Have I already done this already? The hand anchor mark? It's pretty. And the breach was pretty, too. In a destroy-everything sort of way. <laughs> you're not quite what I was expecting. You're a dwarven arcanist. The only one? When you learn things everyone says you can't, you get to be the first. I don't need to tell you. I've looked at Herod's devices. The precision is fantastic, but typical. Mundane. Old thinking. Is what now? No disrespect meant to the classical trades, but you need a new perspective. Yes, he does. Adjustments. As long as I keep making them, you can craft just about anything. Almost safely. Here you go. We found a sword in an elven ruin. Can you do something with it? That broken thing? You can't stitch a sword. Metal doesn't heal. What if it did, though? That would be amazing. Dagna, the sword. Sorry. It's quality, right? I could use the pieces to make a plan for a new sword. One that's less broken. That would be good. Like the pieces are inspiration. That's just perfect for you. Okay, I got another Sullivan blade. Almost, I'm just going to get rid of some stuff. Oh, that's going to take a while. Okay, I got rid of all that. Now, time to get rid of everything else. Ooh. Oh, that's the tongue of serpents. For now, this will be my sword. My sword. My mighty, mighty sword. Another one. Uh, hmm? Hmm? Hmm. Okay.
back there. I'll do this alone. I don't need anybody else. Mm. Come on, game. Load. Not very energetic tonight, I know. Okay, let's do this. I received a letter from the House of Repose, Your Worship. Oh, that's good. They acknowledge their contract is null and void. There is no longer a price on my life. That's good. They're a polite bunch of ruthless murderers. I'll give them that. I regret we were forced to deal with them. That you are endangered by my part in the game. Did I ever mention I used to be a bard? You were a singer. Bards entertain the Orlesian courts. They sing, play music, make charming conversation, and spy. In murder. Many young nobles put on a mask and practice playing the game in such a fashion. What made you interested in becoming a bard? And murderer. I was attending a university in Valroyo when I learned about bards. There was such an air of romance about them. Stories of secrets, trysts, and fascinating people. A group of us, young gentry from Antiva, decided this exciting life was for us. I don't imagine many firstborn heirs join those ranks. Well, I'm sure quite a bit. I was a rather foolish exception. During one particular intrigue, I encountered a bard sent to kill my patron. We fought. Or perhaps scrapped is the better word. Both of us terrified. We were at the top of a steep flight of stairs. The other bard threw a knife, and I pushed him away from me. You can imagine the result. Yeah. You've drawn a clear enough picture. But it was such a waste, Inquisitor. When I took off his mask, I knew him. We'd attended parties together. If I'd stopped to reason, if I'd used my voice instead of scuffling like a common thug... I'll always wonder who that young man would have grown into. From bard to diplomat is quite a change in direction. I was headed down that path for some time already. That night merely crystallized it. In all the commotion... Uh, forgive me, I don't believe I ever thanked you for helping me with this. Hold on to it. Don't lose sight of why you came here. I will never forget you helped save the House of Montillier, Inquisitor. And should you ever visit Antiva, stories of the welcome we'll give you will be told for years. Oh, that's good. I could always use a good party right now. Oh, I could use a really good party. Okay. Okay. So, I am going to do something, something, um, something fun and silly. So, I just saved, so I should be able to do what I need to do. I'm going to turn on some mods, and so I'm going to end the night. I feel like, um... Go in places I shouldn't go. And I can't go places I can't I shouldn't go without a mod to allow me to go places I shouldn't go. So to do that I need to exit the game. So that's why I'm done with the I I I, I, I just shut the game off. I am here right now. So now time to turn on mods.
and then go back in, load up some previous saves, and see if I can go places I can't go. Yes, I want to install that. Okay, merge all these things into the patch. We wait and watch Mod Manager work. I have not been able to get Frosty to work. I would like to get Frosty to work, but I haven't been able to get Frosty to work yet. Okay, we're creating the merch patch. It's been a while since I've done this. It's been a long while. Yeah, really not much going on. Okay, come on. Ooh, I forgot I have no gravity now, too. I just want to see if I can get what I want done. Ugh. I want to go places I can't go normally. Come on, I just want to go places I can't normally go. Load. Oh, come on, hurry up. It's taking forever. Normally I would do this like, you know, during a longer break or something, but I figure I got a half hour to play and I really don't want to start any other quest lines. Task is completed. Close that out. Start the game right back up. Yeah, this week was just last week has just been um, playing Sims and um, watching Babylon Five. Occasionally some YouTube, but mainly Babylon Five because I really wasn't hap wanting to sit at my computer all week. I want to sit in my comfy chair. So I did. I sat in my comfy chair all week. Hopping on my computer for like little bits here to look at Tumblr or, um, you know, just do some browsing and stuff. And then watching TV and playing games. And. That was about it. I had like potato soup left over from the weekend before because I made more potato soup. But with my cough the way it was, I don't see the game loading. Let's try it again. Okay, come on, game load. It's not seeing the game load. Oh, don't tell me there's a mod that's.
probably a mod. It's like a mod I shouldn't have on right now. Okay, let's see. Okay. I want no boundaries. That's primarily what I want. Okay. Let's try merging again. Because I am going to go out of bounds. I am. I want to go out of bounds. Come on, hurry up, game. Load. Oops, that's a good game one. Okay. Okay, I was hoping you could see it, but I guess not. We're going to load. We're going to go places where we shouldn't be able to go. I would like to have a Babylon 5 um, video game. That would be cool. Like one of those Star Trek video games except Babylon 5. Get Walter Koenig back to play Bester for Babylon 5. For, for about blonde five game, I I, I just I just I just want to go against Bester. He's a great villain or a great antagonist, really. I mean, he's doing what he does for the good of his people, but it's not for the good of the other people. He's so charismatic and evil. Really, let Walter Koenig, you know, have fun. Bester seemed like he was a fun villain. You know, allow you to act and have depth and... Ooh, it was good. <laughs> and maybe I'll even watch season five. I don't think I've made it through season five since the original airing. Mainly because... Uh, Babylon 5... Was planned for five seasons, and then they had to do the like all the storyline in the fourth season due to issues. So we never got a fifth season. Well, we got a fifth season, but it wasn't what was planned for fifth season. They finished up all the main storylines and stuff during the uh, during the fourth season. And left some stuff, like some crumbs and stuff they could pick up if they got, you know, somehow got lucky and got a fifth season. And they got picked up by TNT and got a fifth season. I just haven't watched the fifth season because the bulk of the good stuff's gone. Plus one of my favorite characters is gone too. And that's just not right. Okay, the game is not loading right now. It is not loading.
We'll try again. If it doesn't load this time, I'm just going to call it for the night. Give it a couple minutes. So maybe I'll watch Babylon, you know, watch season five soon. I, gotta get the, I wanna get the Blu rays of it so bad. I want like physical media, good quality physical media of it. Right now I'm just watching it streaming on Tubi. And I don't know how long it's gonna be on Tubi. Yeah, I don't think it's loading. I should see something by now. Okay. Well. If that's going to be it, that's going to be it. Uh, next week, we will be doing... Uh, heading into the Arbor Wilds. And dealing with Corypheus and whatever he's looking for in the Arbor Wilds. According to Morgan, it's an allu alluvion. But... Who knows? Plus, I'll have to deal with uh, certain stuff that I do not like. But that'll be next week. On Thursday, uh, I'm going to be doing a little earlier Pokemon at 2 p.m. Uh, I'm going to be hopefully trying to finish off the game. Uh, the base game. And now that I don't have to use the starters, it, it should be easy. I've got, you know, I'll, I've got my um, Cinderace and my Inteleon. And my Rillaboom, so we should be good. We should be good. So, till Thursday, uh, I'm gonna call it until Thursday. Yeah, uh, I will see you on the flip side. Maybe, maybe. See you on the flip side. Bye. <laughs>